Hi Neverlands, it's me Sarah. That sounds so fucking weird. Hi Neverlands. That sounds like I'm doing some kind of advertisement. I just don't want to be like a stranger because I feel like I know everyone who's watching my idle reactions. See, I'm saying idle now. I've been practicing and it feels more normal. So I don't want to be like, hi, my name is Sarah, because you know me by now. So I want to be like, hi, Neverlands, it's me. But that sounds weird. As you can see by the title, we are finally here to react to a guide to G. Idle. It's been... It's overdue, honestly, it's overdue. You recommended me two different guides, but one of them is, I think, like 35 minutes long. I chose, first of all, the one that I'm watching today is an updated version, which I always like because I am also tired of seeing people react to the same old guide on my favorite groups. And I wish that they would check out a more recent one because, you know, a lot of things have changed or like there's more footage that people can watch that explains things better. So um, I feel like I want to watch the updated version but also as i said it's only 18 and a half minutes so i can fit it into my video so that's why i'm reacting to this one but i will check out the other one on my own time as well and one of you who's probably watching right now i guess uh let me know that they also made a guide that guide is 30 minutes long so i won't be able to keep the whole thing in but i will also watch this one right now and i'll just keep in my comments and my reactions to it you probably everyone watching probably knows all the members already but if you feel like it feel free to also check out the guide that one of i'm assuming they're a subscriber i don't know k-pop love but like with a but with a U, K-pop love. And they made a 2020 helpful guide to G Idol. Check it out and leave them some views and some likes. Even before I get into this, I think I have finally figured out my bias situation. I can officially say that my bias is mini and that my bias record is Sujin. We're gonna watch it and see if that stays the same way after I have watched this, but I think so. Finally, I've made my decision. Also, I'm hoping that this might help me because I'm still sometimes confusing Shua and Mion, depending on where they are. I now know that Shua is the magne. I actually thought that Ugi was the magne. I think that's gonna help me a little bit to keep them apart, but I'm still struggling a little bit. But I hope this um, guide will help me. And after this, I'm gonna do Queen them and I'm gonna do covers, solo songs, all of the things, because I really, really, I really want to see all of their stuff, especially the covers, because I heard that Mini has covered some of my favorite songs. So I, 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 I need to see that. So yes, let's watch, finally, an updated helpful guide to G. Idol 2020. Introduction, discography, members, facts, and more. Thank you, Love and Sujin, for this guide. Oh, there is no sound. I'm so stupid. I don't have the thing plugged in. <laughs> Ignore my stupidity. Hello, I assume you want to start standing or learning more about G Idol. Yes. In this video, I will introduce Idol to you, go over their discography, and then venture out to get to know each member individually. Hopefully, this video will help you out. Let's get started. <laughs> Color scheme. G Idol debuted on May 2, 2018, with their first mini album I Am and title track Latida. Such a good. The group consists of six members Soyeon, Miyeon, Mini, Sujin, Yuki, and Shuhua. They are under Cube Shuhua. Entertainment. <laughs> the meaning of the name G Idol is a group of six different personalities gathered together. Their logo is I, N, D, L, E, tilted to the side. G Idol's band. Hold up, hold up, that's fast. I oh is I children oh. DLE tilted to the side G idols fandom name is Neverland and their official colors are neon red and chick violet cool and finally here is a list of their social media accounts that you can follow I didn't know idol okay, meant children now it's time to move on to their discography
That's really cute. G Idol currently have three Korean albums. One Japanese mini album. And three digital singles. Some of Idol's other songs include <gasps> Relay. Ooh, I don't know. Help no. me. Don't know this. And show. Some members have also collaborated with other artists, but we will cover that under each member's profile. Yes. Now let's move on to the member profile section of this video. They have such good songs, I swear. We will start off with our leader, John So Yan. Oh my god, she sounds so like timid. And then when she's in on camera, she was just like in your face. John Soyeon. Soyeon is not only the leader of G Idol, but also the main rapper, lead dancer, vocalist, and plays the center role in the group. Soyeon is born on August 26, 1998. She is a Virgo and is approximately 157 centimeters or 5 oh, right, foot right, 2 right. inches tall. Alongside dancing, rapping, and singing, Soyeon is also a producer for Idol and has written the majority of Idol's discography. Soyeon has also produced and written songs for other artists, one Damn. being CLC's No. She debuted <gasps> as a solo on song. November 5, 2017, with her digital single, Jelly, which was written, composed, and arranged by herself. She featured on KDA, Pop Stars, True Damage, I haven't heard Giants, that song yet. and featured on some other songs such as Wow Thing with Changa, Suoji, and Sin, and I Wanna Be with Chinese Key. So Yan was on Produce She's so One and placed twentieth on the last episode. She joined on Pretty Rapster and placed third. She likes watching anime. One of her favorite anime is One Piece. Favorite color is yellow. She hates vegetables. Oh my god. Loves fried banana. Lives with Yuki and Minnie. Acts chick just so that she can seem intimidating in front of the members and fans. But everyone knows she has that cute, bubbly side. Our French queen. She is commonly shipped with member Yuki. Oh. She is in charge, has a contagious laugh, <laughs> can be a crackhead on occasion, and is just our all-rounder charismatic leader. <sighs> My foot is falling asleep. Next we have Mion. Oh, she's the eldest member, but that's many. Oh. Okay, that's gonna help me. Mion is the eldest and Shua is the youngest. <laughs> oh my god, she's so adorable. She's so pretty. I love that song. Mi so is the main vocalist of Idol. She is also the eldest member of the group but definitely doesn't carry the most brain cells because she is a crackhead. <laughs> oh no. She is born on the 31st of January in 1997, an Aquarius, and is about 163 centimeters, or 5 foot 4 inches. Mi Yun is a former YG trainee mm. since 2015. Someone told and was me that in my last to reaction. With Blackpink. She is Idol's power vocal. She is Ooh. in League of Legends group, KDA, featured on Pop Stars, and Cart with Hangzhou. She is left handed. Her favorite color is green, can play piano and violin. She has started thinking about making her own music for Idol yes. one day. She is friends with Promise 9 members Jiwon and So Yan. Lives with Shuhu and Sujin. She loves to tease Shuhu up. Shuhu. Shuhu. <laughs> 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 
이게 내 거지, 내게 네 거지. 이상하게 불러? 착하지 하지 마요. 언니 수지 언니 아니야. 착각하지 마. 꿈 꿈게. Part of the Sujin and Shihu love triangle. Oh my god. Commonly shipped with member Mini. Despite her age, she is definitely one of the main crackheads of the group and knows how to have a good time. She can teleport. She can teleport? <laughs> and is our flexible queen. <laughs> Set Myun can also speak Japanese. Now we will move on to Mini. Same. <laughs> it's literally me. Baby. Minnie is a Thai K-pop idol. She is the main vocalist and was born on the 23rd of October in 1997. She is a Scorpio and is approximately 164 centimeters. Or almost all my bases were tall. born in 97. It's just Minnie has a such a soft year. yet powerful voice. Cursed and a good voice. Can't speak. What is featured on Wengi's song, wait, wait, Empire. Wait, wait, I want to see. Uh, Korean, English, Japanese, Chinese, and Thai. Wrote and produced Blow Your Mind on G-Idol's I Made Mini album. And show from JTBC's Sugarman. Loves photography and cameras. Appeared Same. on Pentagon Maker. She is friends with CLC's Sorn and Blackpink's Lisa. Can play the piano. Fan of Super Junior. Tomboy fashion style we love IT. Her favorite color is pink. Lives with Soyeon and Yuki. Left handed. Yes. She is in a Thai group chat with Bam Boom from GOT7. Bam Boom. Nichkin from 2pm. Sorn from CLC. Lisa from Blackpink and 10 from NCT. Loves Troy Sivan. Has oh, a me cute too. voice. Oh my god. Gets jealous and sulky when Mi Young doesn't give her attention. Sujin is just there. Commonly oh shipped with Mi-Yan. Has to get her screen time in every eye talk. <laughs> and that's oh, it for Mini's so profile. Cute too. Oh my god, I love her. Now let's move on to Sujin. What the fuck? <sighs> Sujin is well known as the main dancer and idol. She is also a vocalist and she is born on the 9th of March 1998, is a Pisces, and is about 164 centimeters, or 5 foot 5 inches tall. Sujin is probably the softest and shyest member of Idol, until she is performing on stage. She is also the member considered to hold the only brainsel in the group. <laughs> Sujin was about to debut with girl group Vivi Diva in 2015, and even performed once with them before she became a trainee at Cube. Mm. She has a heavenly voice. Can dance like a pure angel and devil at times. <laughs> she has eight tattoos. Her nickname is Cherry. She can cook very well. She is so effortlessly cute. Her charisma on stage got the gaze falling for her. She rocks high heels. Loves red lipstick. Used to do taekwondo. Commonly shipped with Shuhua. Begged her father to become an idol for two years. Very humble. Doesn't believe her impact yet. 
lives with Mian and Shuhua pretends she doesn't love Shuhua much when the camera is rolling, yet, everyone knows how much she adores Shuhua. Now let's move on to Yuki. Her name is pronounced Uki, right? We are now on member five of six. Meet Yuki. They're all so gorgeous. Song Uki? Yuki is a foreign K-pop idol. She is Chinese, the lead vocalist, lead dancer, and the face of the group. She is born on the 23rd of September in 1999, is a Libra, and is about Libra. 162 Libra. centimeters. She's so cute. Yuki is such a cutie. Just look at her. If you looked at pictures of Yuki, I would guarantee that you would assume her voice is high-pitched, but it's actually the total opposite. Yuki is getting into producing. She has a deep, husky, powerful voice. Many Loves to dance and rap. Ooh, I love her voice. Her deep voice got girls going crazy. <laughs> she speaks three languages English, Korean, and Chinese. Commonly shipped with So Yan. <laughs> She is definitely the fake Macni. She is very popular. Yeah. The group's cutest member tries too hard to be chick like So Young just so she can look intimidating, but it will never work. Associated with giraffes, fan of NBA, she loves LeBron James, hip hop. Yo, what's up, man? <laughs> loves meat, especially Jockball. Friends with Wavy member Lucas was the strongest member of Idol, but I'm pretty sure it's Sujin now. Lives like with physically so strong? Me, very loud at times. Knows how to make So Yeon fall for her. The group's troll crackhead teases Shuhua a lot. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> and loves to make everything a little more fun in the group. Now that we are finished with Yuki, we should move on to the oh, final. Hold on, hold on. Uki, Uki, Uki. Now I'm like, Uki, right? Knows how to play the. Okay. Also knows how to dance because she learned it when she was little. She was at one of the top high schools in Beijing. She really loves Super Junior and a lot of the dance. She was to rap on the right when she was in the Chinese program. Keep running. Her favorite American artist is Dua Lipa. Member and maknae of the group, Shuhua. Shuhua. We are now on to our final member of the group, Shuhua. The way they're all so pretty, I don't understand. Shuhua is a foreign K-pop idol. She I'm is just Taiwanese, Taiwanese and moved to Korea when she was just 16 years old to become a K-pop idol. Shuhua wow. is a vocalist, visual and the mainstay of the group. She is born on January the 6th of 2000, which makes her a Capricorn, and is about 161 centimeters, or 5 foot 3 inches tall. I'm taller than all of them, Shu just is a little bit. funniest member. She is also the youngest member of the group. Wants to be an entertainer, but she already is. She is the group's crackhead. Has a 4D personality according to Sujin. She had a hard time as a trainee because of the language barriers. Mm. Very protective over her woman, Sujin. Relatable. <laughs> wow, she looks so good. So good. That was for... The way I relate to both of them. Lives with Sujin and Mia Ian. She knew of K-pop through her friends. Likes watching dramas. Hyuna inspired her to become a singer. Hmm. Only so now, but I'm only so far. 
Make Sujin cook for her. Hey, Sujin. strawberries. <gasps> Likes chocolate. Used to be roommates with Sujin. She has Hollywood actress potential. <laughs> Her hair is, oh my god. <laughs> Can speak Chinese and Korean, sleeps a lot, has admitted to sleeping in Sujin's bed whenever she isn't in the dorm. Relatable, I sleep a lot too. the funniest magnets in the K-pop industry today. We have now completed all sections of the guide. I hope that this guide helped you become an Everland and helped you get to know a bit more about our girls. In the description, I have put the link to a playlist of all of my idol compilations. If you are looking to stand even harder by getting to know each member's personality better, these compilations would most probably help you familiarize yourself with the group a lot more. Also in the description, there will be a link to Idol's I Talk episodes. I recommend Ooh. you watch those from the beginning for a better feel of what the girls are like behind the stage. I cannot guarantee that all information those? on this video about each member is 100% but I did research to the best of my ability, and I am sorry if I had messed anything up in the making. A final thanks to my good friend Maha, and to K-pop Profiles for helping me validate some of the information in the guide. I will link Idol's K-pop profile in the description too. Thank you for watching. See you all in the next video. Thank you for making this guide. Okay, so that was the updated helpful guide to Idol. I did learn quite a few things. I learned, first of all, I didn't know that Idol meant children. I thought it was a play on like K-pop Idol. I know it's spelled differently, but I thought it was just a play on that, especially with the G. I thought it was like, okay, female idols, but apparently that's not at all how it really is. Second of all, Minnie loves Troye Sivan. Same. I mean, okay, I think this confirmed to me what I said before, that I think Minnie is my bias and Sujin is my bias wrecker. She's wrecking really hard, but yeah, I think it's just like, I'm very similar to Minnie, but she's even better than me. So I want to like aspire to be like her, but Sujin is the person that I need in my life and I want to marry. So there you have it. Also, I didn't know, I so they have six members, right? Six, six members, well, and three of them are Korean and then three are not Korean. Uh, that's amazing. I didn't know that. It's like half their group is actually not Korean. So that's really cool. I like that a lot. Also means that they, the whole group speaks a lot of languages just based on where they come from, but most of them speak multiple languages. So that's amazing. I'm now also going to watch K-pop Love's guide. It's 30 minutes, so I'm not going to keep in the whole thing, obviously. Obviously, I'll just add in my commentary, but yeah, I'll watch that too now and see what I what I learn on top of what I already learned. Thank you for making this guide and thank you for telling me about it. <laughs> I did not expect that. In Korean, their name means a group of young people, and do is a suffix for plural, so idol is a play on words that means a group of six individuals in Korean. Oh, that's what the other guy. I didn't really understand what the other guy was saying with like, um, is like a thing of all of the members. I thought maybe it was their initials, but then one letter would be missing, so I didn't really understand what they meant, but here I understand it. Every day, every night, la ta ta. She took me to the sky. Oh my god. Such good songs. I also like that all their albums start with I. It's really, it's really cool. Oh, that's what you were talking about that she wrote it in like 
in a short time for the show. Oh, that's cute. I like that. We do. She's so recognizable instantly. Her voice and her tone. She's so cute. She doesn't. Yeah, exactly that. Oh, wow. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> She's so cute. She's really cute. <gasps> Bay. Oh my god. I love her voice so much. I don't even know. She has such a unique color. Hi everyone, I'm Mimi from G Idol. Oh, 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 she's so cute. Same. It would be nice if I can do a collaboration with you. Oh my god, that would be amazing. Oh my god, I didn't know I needed this. I saw him live too. Oh my god. Oh my god, he reposted it. <gasps> Oh, Jessie J! Oh my god, she has such good taste. Mini. Mini is my favorite. She has taste. Sexy as fuck. True, true, true. This is just... <laughs> What's that Twitter thing? I'm looking respectfully? Mm -hmm. Everyone wants Sujin. Can we blame them? Not really. Oh my god, she's so cute. <gasps> That's Moonbyul, oh my god. <laughs> oh god. Moonbyul and Sujin in the same room together. Oh my god, they're literally my two, the two biggest crushes that I have on female K-pop idols. Moonbyul and Sujin. What is this? What is happening? It does sound really nice. With mini, Ooh. <laughs> she's so pretty. Oh, her voice in Chinese is even better. Love the Undertale music, too. What is happening? <laughs> oh no, she's so cute. Oh. Ooh. Oh, I love the sound of that. <laughs> Same. Same. <laughs> She's like, what are you talking about? We were making out. <laughs> Definitely. That was a really great guide. I definitely learned even more about them. Thank you very much to K-pop Love for making this guide and for telling me about it. You put a lot of work in it and it shows. It's really nice. It's a lot of fun to watch it. I love when guides introduce all the songs in the beginning because then I can sing to them. <laughs> so this was really great. So please go and leave a like on the guide if you would be so kind. Feel free to now finally leave me any links to Queen Them performances or uh, solo slash cover songs by any of the members. I will gladly watch them. But also let me know if you'd be interested in me reacting to the I Talk episodes. I would love to do that because I'm sure they're a lot of fun to watch. Yeah, that's all for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.